G'day, uh, making another little video and um, <clears throat> this time it's all about piston to bore clearance and uh, this is a 98 Merlin engine and I'm fitting a uh, 50.40 um, medial piston which is a Teflon coated piston uh, micrometer uh, sitting in its little stand <clears throat> and uh, the bore clearance uh, instrument which we use to measure the bore clearance. The most important thing is to measure the piston correctly. So the piston is usually biggest at this point here uh, and it's usually cam ground, which means it's, it's big here and it's tapered as well, uh, which means the bottom part of the piston is usually fairly parallel. The top has a slight taper. So today's uh, temperature is at around about 20 degrees at ambient temperature, which is really good for uh, doing piston ball clearance. <clears throat> so the, the way we measure the clearance is measuring the piston first. So um, I, I um, hold the piston like this and uh, I usually just wipe the surfaces of the piston where I'm going to measure it just to make sure that there's nothing on them and also the face of the micrometer. So <coughs> I um, like to hold the um, <coughs> piston stably like this and uh, just rotate it around. Uh, it's not a tight fit in the in the jaws of the micrometer and it's um, I, I can just if I was to let that go it would just hold its own weight. Uh, it's probably a little bit tight so I can back that off a little bit and I need to um, get an accurate sizing. So this is how I, I measure it. So now that I've got a, the biggest part of the piston here is, is, um, is measured across here. So I'm confirming that by just roll, rolling it around to get the right size. So now that we've established that that's the biggest part of the piston, I'll put that down. This is the piston and ball clearance uh, instrument. Um, so we set this at zero. I like to hold it like this. Hold it in the, in, the, in the gauge, in the micrometer, and rotate it around and make sure that we get zero here. Very, very important that this is zero. So my dial is telling me that it's zero here, and then the, the little scale is telling me that it's number four on the small scale. So when I then put that into the, uh, the, the bore, so I'll take that out gently, put this into the bore, um, and I can measure the clearance. So in this case, I've got a 115 microns. Uh, I've already honed this, and uh, it's 100, 112 to 115 microns, um, which I, I'm happy for this one. It's, uh, it's a fairly good bore, and uh, this engine will do 19,000 RPM, so at 115 microns, I'm happy with that. So uh, that's a nicely freshed, freshly honed bore. Um, <coughs> as you can see, the bore's nice and uh, nice and clean. It's been honed, and um, that's uh, hopefully that gives you an insight into what we do.